Alrighty, uh, it is January 31st. This is the 31st episode of Bedhead. I'm Maximilian Robert Lockwood. Let's jump right into it. Um, deep fake technology is scary. And uh, I mean, deep fake technology exists, AI deep fakes of voices exist. Um, and what's uh, leading me to talk about this right now as I saw there's an article talking about how um, deep fake uh, tech has been used to superimpose different streamers uh, video game streamers twitch streamers what have you po uh, superimpose their faces into pornography um, and of course there's been you know other celebrities superimposed into pornography because of course um, and that's the thing about AI is that it can be used for, you know, in ways that are obvious and also in ways that we wouldn't necessarily have thought about on the front end. AI is relatively short-sighted, um, because, uh, you know, in its development, which is why a number of different entities have, um, you know, scientific minds and everything, great minds, quote unquote, have warned uh, about it. And deep fakes, I mean, first of all, it is very invasive. It violates uh, the individuals involved, especially of, you know, any, any person, um, famous or not, however you want to, you know, qualify fame. Um, it's incredibly, I mean, it, it's just, it can ruin somebody's life. Granted, at this point, as far as I understand, there's still watermarks or there's still evidence that allow you to distinguish, differentiate, um, the real from the deep faked, but with evolving technology, who's to say whether or not that signature is going to disappear over time and thus the effects the 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 um superimposition of said likenesses audio clips whatever are uh, only going to get better and therefore it might be indistinguishable someday um and it's probably not far off to think about you know could this start skirmishes? Could this start wars? Having some deep faked leader, you know, state something uh, uproarious, incendiary, bombastic that then leads to confrontations, leads to lives lost um, before it's too late, before or before uh, anybody can, um, you know, call it out as a lie, a falsehood. It might be too late for for certain individuals. Um, scary stuff and it is very difficult to rein in certain technologies once they're already publicly available and out on the internet and everything anyway uh that's my that's what occupying my brain at the moment uh i'm maximilian robert lockwood you guys take care of yourselves have a wonderful tuesday i will see you tomorrow